Hi Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure to hit the subscribe button and also give me a thumbs up. If you would like a personal reading, how you can purchase one is down in the description box, okay? So this is your May 10th, 11th reading. We're gonna see what your person's intentions are here, okay? What is your person's intentions? For May 10th to the 11th, What is your person's intentions? I hope all of you had a happy Mother's Day. Okay. What is your person's intentions? May 10th to the 11th. For my Sagittarius. Sagittarius, please, share God's angels universe. What is your person's intentions for my Sagittarius, please? What is your person's intentions for my Sagittarius? Sagittarius, what is your person's intentions? We're going to go with it. We have the Queen of Cups here and the Four of Swords. Okay. Let's keep going. So I feel like with the Hierophant. Okay. Let's see here. Let me get a couple more cards out. Okay, let's see here. The two of wands in reverse. So no action being taken toward this commitment. Let's see. Your person's in his intentions is to yikes. We have the seven of swords, the eight of pentacles, and the three of wands. So your person's intentions in the five of cups at the bottom of the deck with the moon. The ace of pentacles, the ten of swords, ten of pentacles, the five of pentacles. Your person is intentions is to leave your ass out in the cold or you them. The judgment card flipped out in the reverse. Okay, or somebody, this was you or somebody else, or somebody been lying around money, eight of pentacles. I don't know that, why this coming out and everybody's reading. Seven of swords, eight of pentacles coming out next to each other. Somebody's been lying here about money, hiding money in foreign accounts for some of you or whatever the fuck. But this queen of cups possibly has been lying. It could be around an institution, something that you, maybe you work with this person, all right, or whatever. But somebody here has definitely uh, not been honest, less than honorable with the judgment in reverse. The spirit guys are, do not condone what this person has been doing here at all. Okay, somebody very sneaky very sneaky a thief the seven of swords coming out with the eight of pentacles around work a government institution or an institution or some kind of organization or business with the higher font this person their intentions ain't good Sagittarius you can believe that what is the seven of swords let's clarify somebody here asked for to be left out in the goddamn cold yeah left behind somebody's turning their back on the situation yeah two of swords they're no longer willing to get to this situation at all four of cups they're not happy or, or content yeah and then we have the uh temperance card in the world so this could be you yeah with the six of swords and the in the empress card and the four of wands you may be relocating or moving in with a libra doesn't have to be okay yeah but ten of swords is over with okay yeah I have the Seven of Cups with the Hangman, which is Piscean energy, with the Magician. Okay, because, yeah, somebody was being a master manipulator, a con, this Pisces energy. Okay, yeah, somebody's going to make an offer towards someone from their past. Knight of Cups to the Six of Cups. Could be a water sign, or, the, or you could have water in your chart. But, yeah, you're going to, uh, you could be taking someone flowers, is what I'm hearing. We have the Seven of Pentacles. You've been waiting to make this offer. Yes, yeah, son. It could be to a Leo. Or this person can have Leo in their chart. Or it could be a Taurus. But you've been waiting to make this offer toward this person. Yeah. It could be a Libra with the Empress in the world coming out. Or maybe you had to end something with the mother of your kids first. That's for some of you. 
And then some of you are starting a new cycle with a Libra. Okay, yeah, you're moving toward this person. You could even be moving in with this person. Six of Swords, Four of Wands. That's for some of you, not all of you. This person has a beautiful home, whoever you're going towards. A beautiful condo, house, apartment, whatever it is, yeah. King of Pentacles, you want to make an offer here, Sagittarius. Okay. Toward this, um, this Libra. You want stability and long term here. And you're moving away from this thieving, lying person over here. Now, somebody is definitely a thief. And this just is what it is. Seven of Swords coming out right with the Eight of Pentacles. That shit is over with. And then look, the Ten of Swords fell out again. Something is over. Somebody stabbed somebody in the back for a long time. I'm hearing the whole time they was in a relationship. It's been arguments and fights, emails is found, whatever the fuck. But yeah, they work with this person. The whole time they was in a relationship, this person has emotionally manipulated someone with the Queen of Cups. They can be very evil. Very much. They're very loving and all that on one side. Very intuitive. Very spiritual or whatever. But on the other, they're very manipulative. Very much liars. Very much secretive. This person over here is, um, yeah, and you're blocking your energy, seven of wands. You may be blocking it from several people that stabbed you in the back in this institution here, okay? It could have been several people doing it, and you're done, Sagittarius. You had a page of swords. You found out what you needed to find out. You dug, you did some research. You found, because the pages, this represents online. The page of swords is online, so you looked online. You saw something online, you know, whether it was emails, where, whether it was whatever, but you discovered what this person was doing by looking online. Okay. Yeah. And now you know exactly what it is. Yeah, we have a moon here with the fucking uh, king of swords and three of pentacles. Yeah, there were secrets around somebody that's your manager. Somebody that's your boss with the king of swords can be a manager or your overseer or, or whatever. They've been keeping secrets about money or about the business with the three of pentacles being very emotionally manipulative towards you and everything. Now somebody's act crying, laying in the bed all day, crying and depressed and don't know what to do. But they was breadcrumbing your ass, though. Keeping money for they self -white while your ass is over here probably working hard for the shit. Okay? Yeah, now you want to do something new. You have a new idea. You want to go somewhere new, do something new. And you're very passionate, Sagittarius. This is you about this new idea or about this new person that you're going towards. Okay, yeah, the secret is out. Moon fell out in the reverse, right over here on top of this energy. The secret is, is out. Your person's intentions was to steal from you and to, and to use you for money is what I'm hearing. 808 on the clock, that's the number of abundance. Yeah, somebody was only with you for money is what I'm hearing. And that's just some real shit because you could provide. Yeah, very selfish and stubborn. Wanted to hold everything to the... Um, um, for themselves and you discovered that okay tell me more about this queen of cups sitting up there like she depressed now queen of cups and the four swords what's this queen of cups and four swords sitting up there looking stupid for and i say that because like if you're gonna steal this shit and be a thief don't sit there and act depressed after your ass is discovered about it don't act like you don't you don't fucking uh realize what you were doing okay period point blank please do not act like that we have the strength in the reverse somebody that wasn't loyal okay somebody that needs to pick themselves up and get back to it they laying in the bed depressed crying ain't combed they fucking hair or nothing else in days all right Acting like they was the ones betrayed, but they the ones did the betraying. Here's the Ace of Swords in reverse and the lying and the creating illusions. This Queen of Cups is full of shit, and I don't like it. Yeah, taking money, moving it out of accounts, and juggling and doing shit like that. I don't like this person's energy because they're a master manipulator. They knew exactly what they were doing, and they brought the tower upon themselves with the tower in reverse. Scorpio energy. Yeah, around this job, working with somebody. This is literally in a contract, working with somebody. 
somebody was doing what's best for them. Now the tower has fallen and they brought it on themselves because of their sneaky ass ways with the seven of swords being there. And now they want to act like they so fucking depressed. No, don't do that. Please don't do that. Yeah, you're doing something. Oh, oh okay, hold on. I'm going to just take these. Let's see. We have the Queen of Wands, the uh, Will of Fortune, and the Ace of Pentacles. I feel like you're, there's this energy over here, this beautiful energy, because this is very dark. All these tens of swords, tower, moon in reverse, seven of swords, sneaky shit, and all this beautiful yellow energy, very healing and loyal, okay? You're deciding to go over here, okay? Judgment has been called, the will of fortune, this is your destiny over here, okay? A absolutely your destiny. Ace of Pentacles, will of fortune with this queen of wands energy. Somebody you have a lot of passion for, you're highly attracted to here, Sagittarius. They could be at a distance with, from you with the three of wands, but you're going to be traveling to go see this person or move in with this person. Yeah. Very much your emotional fulfillment. Somebody's here is highly celebrated as well. You don't deserve no shit like this, man. I don't deserve it. You don't deserve it. Nobody don't deserve it. This person could be a business owner with the Queen of Pentacles. They own their own business. They work from the ground up to have it. This person could work from home as well. Yeah, the devil fell out over there like that. This person you were dealing with was a karmic or the devil, and you rejecting their ass. You no longer want it. Discontent and unhappy. You're not willing to deal with it, and I don't blame you. Or this could be you, Sagittarius, who was stealing this shit. Yeah, nine of Pentacles in reverse. Money ain't right or something. Losing money, whatever. This could be you or the other person. But somebody don't deserve no shit like that. Yeah. Somebody could have went to a psychic with this high priestess that showed itself. Yeah, there's a breakup with a karmic. We have the lovers in reverse. Yep, there was a karmic relationship there. Something that was not meant to, to stand the test of times. Eight of Wands is blocked. If you stay in that relationship, it will not grow. It will not go anywhere. And the universe will not bless it. Just as simple as that. You could stay in it and continue to be, yeah, five of Wands arguing and fighting. Maybe with this person amongst other people. It could be five people attacking you or they stabbed you in the back. Or seven people or a group of people. But if you decide to stay in this shit, that's exactly what you're going to continue to get. Or this could be the other person with you, Sagittarius. The cycle is over. Whatever you needed to learn, you learned it. Go live your life now. You deserve it. Go be happy. Go be happy doing you. Sagittarius is our philosophers. Highly intelligent. Very smart. Okay? They can do anything that they want to do or that they put their money into, and they deserve it. And if this is the opposite person, they deserve it as well, and they need to get the fuck away from your ass. Y'all know which side of the story y'all on, okay? Yeah, just seeing this Queen of Cups right here at the bottom of the deck in reverse, this same Queen of Cups. Very emotionally manipulative. Somebody that has outbursts that can't control themselves. And then I see the queen of, I see the world in reverse. And then the queen of pentacles in reverse. With the judgment in reverse. The ace of wands in reverse. Yeah. This relationship is not going to go nowhere. Period. There's no passion left there. There's no love. There's no respect. There's no none of that. Okay. There is no none of that. Yeah, somebody's very passionate about this. And then we have the king to the queen of wands. All right. These are two people that is twin flames meant to be with each other. Okay. Look how they look at each other. All right. Yep. They're going to be working together. There's that three of pentacles again. Two people that are going to have a successful business that's going to be worldwide. Yep. Lots of money. Or somebody here is very independent and has their own business. Okay, very abundant. This may be the person you want to go towards. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. You've been wanting to make an offer towards for quite some time. All right.
and Ace of Swords. Yep, you're very clear on this. Ace of Swords could be a reconciliation as well. You're tired and defeated in this other relationship that ain't going nowhere. Yeah, we have the Ace of Pentacles here as well. Also could be a proposal to someone. All right. And then what's the last card? The Judgment with the Will of Fortune. Absolutely 100% meant to be. We have the Will of Fortune here twice. This is your destiny. This person is your destiny. The person you're meant to be with. It was written in the stars for you, Sagittarius. Literally written in the stars. Okay. You need to block your energy and block yourself from this person right here. Okay. That you were dealing with. That's the liar. The seven of swords that's over here. And here it is again. You need to block yourself from this person. Okay, you're no longer confused with the seven of cups in reverse. You know you need to walk away. You know that. And the, um, with the empress and the death, this could be the mother of your kids. Doesn't have to be, but it's over. So those are the messages I have for you, Sagittarius. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.